Hello my friends, uh, this short film will be about how to make a à la demande pool. There is a difference between a regular pool shaft and a one for the à la demande. As you can see here, the à la demande pool is very very low, is like a half circle and that is because in à la demande settings there are two riders on the pool horses and uh, to get the rider to have a free access for the legs you have to take down the pole further down to the ground and the Royal Muse asked me to make uh, uh, a new pole or rather a used one to change the used one for one of the kaleshes parade kaleshes or in English barouche so we find an old one and these poles they are heavy they are scattered by iron underneath and some of them even on the sides and uh, and the uh, place where you put it into the wagon is uh, covered by iron anyway I took it home I took away all the iron and uh, was taking away the color the old color and uh, start working on it I have to extend it in the part that should fit into the carriage and uh, I have also to put in a new a new pool crab a uh, pool crab that was made of brass and gold for the uh, kalesh that it was should, that kalesh that this pool should fit to so it was kind of work the uh, take away the old iron on the side i have to glue some wood into the uh, uh, inserting part and take away a few nails so I could uh, sanding it and uh, make make new iron so fit perfectly to the carriage and even cut away so I could fit the new pool the new pool crab when this was done I even have to put on some more wood on the sides of the uh, of the pole because the horses had been eating on it and here you can see where I'm taking down the wood to fit the new pole crab and this is the one that is made of brass and uh, some parts of it is gold after everything was okay I took it over to the uh, to the uh, paint shop before that I had to sand it completely uh, clean from all old colors and then in the paint shop I put on as usual three layer of, of um, uh, uh, base paint and uh, that paint is made of, uh, of uh, uh, lead, lead pigment, gold size, linseed oil and so on to make it stable after that I put on eight layer of this brown uh, base color also and that you sand away and then you put on eight layer of the regular oil alkyd color and uh, that color I can put on wet in wet and let it dry for about one week and then after that I do the striping and the striping is done by bronze and gold pure gold and on top of that I put on three layer of varnish or lacquer or whatever you call it in English and uh, this is how it looks like the new one when you fit into the carriage and it uh, fit nicely this time here and uh, they could use it right away 
and they have been using it since that and the Royal Mews are um, very satisfied so um, it's nice to have done the job that they can use for several years in front of us okay thank you very much for looking and have a nice day